Don't go over there. Here, here you go, buddy. You put this underneath the outside of your foot. Put your the original hammer. You have the original the hammer. The original one, bud. <laughs> It's one from Dad's. That's one from that Dad's is, woodshed right that there. Is, that's, that's Grandpa's hammer right there. That is actually Grandpa's hammer, I'm sure. So keep Dad's. it on the inside. Mm -hmm. Full swing or pause? Oh, full swing. Post. Oh, dude. It just it does that to everybody, by the way. Oh, my it, God. <laughs> it just shoots them right through. Holy cow. Uh-huh. And you know what's funny? Did you, see, did you see how you ended? You ended like this was deeper and back, and we were like, whoa, I'm like still in my posture right here. But that was a game changer. And what it did was- Because I'm here. Yes. Not... Let's, let's think about that logically for a second. If I'm a pitcher, and I use the plate like this, and let's say I stand up flat on the plate, and then throw it. Or if, how about if I get on the inside of that plate, and then throw it, right? You're pushing, you're pushing that way to open up. You're not pushing from the flat of the foot. It'd be the same thing throwing. If I'm throwing from back here, you know, there's gonna be nothing, but if I'm pushing from in here, well, there's the pop to it. It'd be the same thing batting. It'd be the same thing even when you're running, right? Those guys aren't starting from the flat of the foot. It's from the inside and pushing off and getting right. an angle. And I can't get stuck. That was, that was not, that's there. exactly right. That was your best swing of the day by far. That was an awesome job. Billy, good morning. How you doing, bud? Grandpa's hammer, I nice like to this see you hammer drill. Not sure I want to carry a hammer in my golf bag. I walk a lot. I'm gonna forget I have it in there. <laughs> That's what you that walk one. Big old heavy walk around with an extra six pounds. No, in the but you bag. know what works about that thing? You can pop the top right off, and then you just use the wood. I want one of those Thor's hammer. I'm gonna get like a huge <laughs> post. There it is. Oh, I felt myself slide back. It's close though, dude. It was it better. Was close. You, you know what's funny? You get much more zip through impact when you have that. But you can feel, like I slid back a little bit and my foot moved, so you can you you get that? like instant feedback. Mm -hmm. have all these fancy tools. Who would have thought that a hammer is the easy button? Oh, don't do that. That was just reaching. The, the, the slide, it's still there. I know, that's gonna help though, just Scott, banking yourself there on the inside. And pushing off to open up. Oh, yeah, yeah. If you need to, if you need to move it around, just, just don't get my. Uh, I was playing it like a six iron. It's a right. wedge. But it's good feedback, though, isn't it, Brian? Yeah, instant. I mean, and simple. And I won't get funny looks on the range. So people can't see that I'm standing on a hammer. <laughs> Post. Yeah. Close it's, with that. It's elbow. a good swing, though, dude. Elbow. It's a really good swing. Did you want? Did you want to hit anything else before you before yeah. you take off today? Just kind of like some little longer, just kind of. What do you think? Like a six seven something like that, or you mean like a wood? Yeah, I mean just any anything. Just if you want, if you want me to check on any of the other, I mean, it's, it's the same thing with everything. It's yeah. nothing's going to change as far as what I'm asking you to do, but just want to make sure you. Let's fire a hybrid after this too. Let me hit. Oh, it look at this. those head covers you got. That's an old school one. It's got my kid's camping wow. logo on it. That has some zip to it right there, huh? Closer. Closer, closer. Just take a little, a little practice. Little fat. Just get that practice swing with that right, that right knee just more inside that right instep. It's still sliding out? Yeah, just a little bit. The longer club, I knew it would a little bit. That's why I wanted just to get you hitting a couple of these to get some feedback. Yeah, there you go, Brian. And start with it a little bit like this. You know, you want you, you of all people need a little bit of that Arnold Palmer, Gary Player kind of, just get it kind of. <laughs> Kinked in there a little bit, you know? Yeah. It's my fitness that makes you, reminds you of a player, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> You're good. Yeah. Oh, it's so close. Oh, there dude. it is. There it is. Uh, it's to me more about what's the body doing efficiently, right? There's two words I use. Below the belt, it's a load. Above the belt, it's a coil, right? The load happens into this leg right here, into the inside of the leg, to the instep, right into that hip. Feel it right in the glute. You can really feel that. Now, 
From there, there's a big coil that happens when the spine angle's in the right spot with the pelvis, where I get the upper body really turning to complete my swing and don't just have the arms hiking up alongside my body. The worst look, this is what used to be what I remember back a long time ago. When this knee goes out and this shoulder stops right here and these arms go up there, there's just nothing worse when I watch from the face on me. I think, what, what's, what's gonna happen, right? But, yeah. boom, that's our key, buddy. That's our key. The longer the club, the more the right knee on the inside, all that good stuff. Say that last one again, the longer the club, the more. The longer the club, the more that you feel like that right knee stays on the inside of your right foot, only because the more it tends to get outside the foot. The that. Exactly. Remember, you keeping that knee there is gonna be a, a, a basically a symbol for no lateral movement. What's funny is, with Bikram just before you, just the other day, we were working on making sure his knee didn't pull towards the target like this. We're working on loading more on top of it, right? But it's just, for you, you need to feel the exact opposite and feel like it's actually going towards the target, right? And that's, and that's just to help neutralize it. Just don't jam down like that. So the one thing that I would tell you, Brian, that you want to work on the top of your swing, though, just you know, to make sure that you keep working towards the right thing. So you get to a good spot right here, and then this arm will give way on you and break down and bring the arms closer to you. Just keep, from this position right here that you get to a good spot, keep the width that you have. And just keep the arms more pinched together. Don't feel the arm collapse alongside Checking you. In. Yeah. A lot of times people misinterpret right elbow in, and they think right elbow in. <laughs> In is not into the body. In is closer to the left arm, rotated in. External with the shoulder. I always say internal with the elbow. Makes sense. It's going in this way, right? That's rotated in, not into the body. Yeah, one more good one. I yeah, want, didn't, I didn't hit a hybrid and then we can. Oh, I felt myself slide, don't slide. Now it's like, now yeah. I'm aware of it, which is good. The old drill that Brian will remember that I used to have him do too, used to help open up his turn and used to prevent him sliding. Was Remember the left leg drill, Brian? Always had you doing this one back a long yeah. time ago where you drop one leg back and be rotating around that lead leg, taking away that opportunity. It just basically essentially creates the post, right? You know, when the right, when the right leg's back here, if you lose that post, you would just fall. So having that leg there and this one here, it not only opens up the turn, but really identifies the post, doesn't allow you to slide. How you doing, Frank? It's closer. Good, buddy. Oh, that was so much closer. Let me see. Yeah, I'm nice to be back. Around. But you know what's awesome? That was not bad. I just love golf so much because, you know, the one great thing about the sport is just the relationships, you know? And it's just, I think about, like, this guy means a lot to our golf academy at a time where we were building it. You know, he came as much as he possibly could from a place in the county that probably didn't make sense to come out there. Not zero. <laughs> but he would come hang out with us, you know? And, uh, yeah, we just appreciate you, man. I wrote off all appreciate those you. driving driving miles. <laughs> yeah, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. I feel the same way. No, it's, it's, it's just great to have you back out here and working at it, you know? And hey, the swing's better. Your game's better. The big thing is, let's work on this setup. Let's make sure that we aren't getting outside that foot. Let's make sure we're not collapsing at the top. These are things that are simple for you just to knock away. Post brace, huge. Elbows together and away from your body. I kind of, I like that thought away from the body a little bit. Don't let them break down next to you. Post brace, elbows away. One good pure one, right on top of that green flag. Come on. Football like this. You know why I like that swing a lot right there? Do you see how little his right leg moved? Didn't move, your right leg didn't move out at all. Still up a tiny I know, bit, I know, but and really that's close. where you're gonna have to work real hard to get a, a more, you know, this post, you wanna so badly go laterally. And you just have to really sit there and just work yourself It's been work yourself something back. I hadn't even back. thought, like, uh, I could, you know, just wasn't even aware of. I mean, I knew something was going on. So, all right, last good one, come on, no slide. The brace. You know, can you see though how it takes away all the left? 
Yeah. All the left, right? That little baby fade, I can I play know. that. I know, <laughs> I know, I know. And that's where, just take, yeah. Thanks, brother. Bye, We're getting there, man. Yeah, damn right. Man. Good to see you guys. Yeah, it's good. In and a hey, minute. Um, Mike and I will take you up on the beers, though. Yeah. We'll go meet up and have Small. Thank you guys so much for watching our video. Any questions or comments you have, please leave them below. Also, click the link below to pick up three free videos. We appreciate you guys. Enjoy our channel.